everybody, welcome back to my channel, This Rickety Games. I'm Sydney, and today we are back with Control. So today we are doing chapter five, I believe. It's called Threshold. We gotta go back to maintenance. We gotta go back to Octi and see if he needs anything from us. But we really gotta find this black rock processing um, because we were trying to get the HRA machine to do its thing and it shattered the black prism that we had. And that's not good. So we gotta try again. So we gotta get more of it. So we gotta go find it. So yeah, that's the goal today. And then while we're down there, it looks like we can select the countermeasure. So look at this. His, okay. Maintenance incursion, Hiss Rangers. Kill the Hiss Rangers in the maintenance sector. So there's 10 of them and we get a rare, a random rare weapon mod. It's such a tongue twister every time. So let's do that one. And thank you guys for telling me in the comments that I can select the board countermeasures from here and that the other missions are from here whenever they pop up. Uh, we did try uh, a random mission um, that came up that was like, oh, like go help something or so. And it, it was a disaster because we had 30 seconds left. But if it happens again, we'll we'll see in the moment how we feel what we're up to otherwise it's a party so let's get to maintenance so yes where do we need to go let's go to ventilation because that's right by we probably need to go to the control room because that's where all of the stuff is but let's say hi to Ati let's find out we're, just, we're getting right into it because we gotta. Boom, baby. Marshall knows something about Dylan. Is he here? Is he all right? HRAs first. They'll help save everyone, including Dylan. Once I find him. What if Polaris is Dylan? Can you keep him safe? Like you do with me? Ooh. That was a yes, I'm assuming. Um, what if Polaris is Dylan? <laughs> he just gets like absorbed into her mind. That would be trippy as hell. I don't think that's the case. I don't think he's alive either, to be honest. But I do think that she, that Marshall, she's right. Jesse's right that Marshall does know something because she was like, mm, I knew this was coming. And uh, that's never a good response. Like if somebody's like, oh, you know what I mean? The answer they have for you is complicated and not necessarily good. Um, so where am I going? Where's Ati? His picture's gone. Sir. Hi. Arish? Respects his elders. Makes good coffee. There you go. There you go. That's two things. Can I talk to you? No talk. You look, your hair looks majestic today. I just, I gotta tell you, the, with the light and the, he's jamming. He's just, okay. That's a, oh, we got a thing though. What a mess. Clear the clog. It's back. Damn it, we'd knock that thing back. Clear the clog. In the where? Where is it? Not there. From the pump station. Which is where? Is it in the pipe works? The bureau is trying to dig a hole in their own cellar. Looking for coal. Greedy will have a seat again. <laughs> Always. Mm, this way, right? Should we do the, the clog thing? That'll be quick, right? We want to help Ati, you know what I mean? That's like, like a... Like, we gotta do it. I hope this is the right way. Uh, 
Oh boy, we get some friends. Hi, friends. <laughs> Does not get old. I can get him pretty good with one shot with that thing. With my launch ability. Look at that. Bam! Taken out. So easy with that. I love this. I love this power. It is a good time. Ooh, look at this. We're, we're finding the things. That gross blockage. Zoom. That gross blockage down in the water systems is back. What the fuck is it? And where does it keep coming from? And why the hell does Ati keep yelling nonsense at it? He acts like he can understand him. Of course, he acts like we can understand him too. Guess that's just his brand of crazy. I'm gonna try out a new drain cleaner. Extreme strength. I think you're gonna need more than the drain cleaner to deal with that. Creepy. So I think it's this way. Because this is what we had to do last time. Ew, it is back. Yep, because it's all this shit's back. Ew. Ew, 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 ew. Alright, I got the name of the game though this time, so it's not gonna surprise me with acid sprays. Ooh, look at that. Hopefully. Hopefully it doesn't surprise me with the acid, acid sprays, but I know, like, know what to expect. Oh, yeah. I know what to expect from the the clog this time. So, you know. Mm-hmm. Suspiciously empty. You can tell it's been you. Nope, you can tell it's been here. I love mazes. Especially with ooey gooey things in it. Like, what is it? That's a good question. Because it's like fleshy. If that's the word for it. Alright, so that was this room there seems to be another secret room this way oh I found it it's upstairs not downstairs hello again mr. clog you've really let yourself go Ew. Simulacrum A153-KE Containment procedure. No unique procedures required. If the item's form is different than any previously reported, then make a note of describing the new form. Description slash altered effect. The object's true shape and appearance are unknown. It has been known to take the form of the following objects. Ring of keys, lunchbox, wrench, microscope, stapler, glasses, mail tube, spoon. The item is able to adopt the physical form of items in its immediate vicinity. The item is capable of limited physical movement, repositioning itself whenever it changes form. This only occurs when it is unobserved, physically and digitally. Because of this, the transition between shapes has never been observed. Reciting formula 1i, so I guess it's i, formula i.14 or i.32 causes the items to reveal itself by shuddering. Background. The item was initially discovered within the bureau itself, whether an agent brought it inside intentionally or otherwise, or it resided here prior to the bureau's arrival to the oldest house is unknown. Man, that's so unsettling. Like, a spoon, glasses. Like, could you imagine just, like, wearing glasses and all of a sudden you realize it's not what you think it is? Like, that's terrifying. Oh, boy. Good. 
so it looks like we need to unlock some stuff. I hear it, but I don't see it. Is this a thing? Bam! Oh, it looks like we need a battery there, though. Oh, but there's another battery inside. Ah. Uh -huh. Can I take it back? So what did this open? This door? We came in through here, though. Yeah, no. So this opened what exactly? Coming for me? Friends? Hmm. Maybe I need to do this one first because that's where the battery is, the second battery. Where did I put it? Bring it back. There we go. And then we can get the other one. Yeah, it probably made more sense. Oh, this one opens that one. Okay. Okay. But is it gonna close as soon as I take it? Oh, not that. Yep. That's okay. I got it. I got the name of the game. Bam! Activate the draining pipe. So that's still a lot. Oh. Gotta do this. Aha. We should go down there to clear out the rest of it. Me, myself, my. And, uh. My. Psychic friend. We gotta help Auntie. You know what I mean? We gotta. He helps us. Ooh. It's only fair that we help him. So gross. Really? Bye, Mr. Clog. Yeah. I sincerely hope we never meet again. Truly. Oh, we did it. That was it? Hell yeah. Bam! Nice. Nice, nice, nice. I thought it was gonna be a whole big guy again. Maybe we kicked his ass, uh... Into bits. Alright, well. Party time, then. Moving on. Okie dokie. So, here we are. We're in like the main like hub area. And this should be where we need to go to find the black rock cross. Black? Oh my god. This should be where we need to go to find the black rock processing. Why is everything a tongue twister? So, we there was a door. There was it was like on the other side, I want to say. Like on the other side of this room, like on the other uh, itching for some real. Should we talk to a Rish? He's not here. Everybody chilling? Nope. He's not here. He busy. Already. But it was like around the side, right? Like we saw it when we were doing the last mission, I think. Yeah, like something like over here. Oh my goodness. Oh boy. Yeah, let's not. Thank you. Ugh, it's so disturbing that they're like upside down and like in half. Not a fan. Where are the uh, 
uh, the rangers, sir. Ooh, that was a mistake. Explode me while I'm at it. I should have just thrown something at it instead of waiting for my gun to reload. <laughs> it's okay, we're alive. Um, yes, so I am clearly in the right place. Central maintenance. It's like, wasn't it over this way? It was the door we couldn't open. Yes, no. Yes, right? Black Rock Quarry. Hey. Meh? No? Yes? Oh, it's a big elevator. Concerning. Not there. So it's not in that corridor. I checked. It's just the, the control room that we were at before where we did the override um, and then the maybe this one and then the black rock processing wasn't there but like the quarry we couldn't access it was just level five not worth much time hanging out suspicious what are you guys hanging out in here in the bathrooms for? I terrorize everybody. No toilet paper. I won't do every stall. Hmm. Field training. Ooh, what's that? <gasps> Black rock processing. Okay, but this... So, I can't remember what I was doing, but I realized that you can shoot these. And that this destroys these things. So I was like trying to figure out something with parapsychology after I had filmed the episode. I was like, man, why did it take me forever? Like, how did that door open? Because for me, like I was wandering around and I couldn't find anything. And then I went and round and did like basically anything but parapsychology. When I came back to that door, it was open. And I was like, what did I do? Like, what is it that I triggered? So when I looked it up, they were like, oh, the the red thing that's blocking the door, the way that it's blocking that field training one, there's like those little squares or something, and then like you can shoot them, and then it undoes the, the red stuff. And I was like, when did they tell you that, one? And then two, I don't remember doing that for parapsychology. It's like maybe it just happened when I was like in battle, but I don't know how I unlocked it, but I did. Anyway, I know that now. Examination of paranatural topics thresholds summary not thresholds rule credits the oldest house is a place in flux thresholds appear with no warning what the threshold will contain is a question we can only answer once it manifests the wildly accepted theory is that thresholds are dimensions vibrating on a frequency different from our own when these frequencies match the threshold will manifest in the oldest house which acts as a other theorize others theorize Thresholds are parallel universes, or possibly our own reality at a different point in time. Some believe our collection of altered materials affects the house, or attracts the thresholds. We do know for certain that thresholds are not permanent. Eventually, their frequency will shift. Some believe Earth itself is just another threshold, connected to the oldest house, which is actually rooted in some other reality. This theory, while impossible to disprove, causes in those who learn of it, so it is actively denied. Uh, referred to file 5-05-1881 for full report. Interesting. So yeah, I mean, there is like this idea that like there are other planes of reality or like it's not earthly. Um, I can definitely see that because like a lot of the stuff around the scenes alien. The idea of the thresholds that like appear with no warning kind of make me think of like I don't know, like the the parallel universes or the different point in time, like kind of give me like the the ocean view motel thing. I feel like that's a threshold, like going in and out of something. Seems very interesting. All right, so like 
This is what I was talking about. And like it clears, clears it up. Yeah, it does. Okay, that's wild. I don't know when they told us that, but good defense. What is this one? We're doing anything but the actual mission. <laughs> Investigate the training course. Okay, well we unlocked it. We might as well do it. I'd like to file a formal complaint re the unauthorized use of my voice in a state of quality that I did not agree on. The fact that they were planning to use material from what I thought was a rehearsal was not communicated to me at all. Had it been, I would have disallowed the use of those recordings. I want use of the Ranger Field Training Course recorded messages to halt immediately. I will not stand for this humiliation among my peers. I will go to HR with this if necessary. Signed, Randall Pulaski. Well, sir, sound like you were duped. That's funny. So they like recorded him and then used it. Whoops. Complete the training so, course in our period of time. So I, I just read this. Is this his recording? Welcome to the Ranger Field Training Course. The course must be completed in this specified amount of time. When you're ready to start, press the button. Is that all or? I always did love obstacle courses. Oh my God, that's great. Okay, so I gotta hit the button and then run like a bitch. Get ready, Ranger. Course starting in five, four, three, two, one. Go. All right, let's go. So what do we do? Oh, I gotcha. Forty-five seconds remaining. Uh oh. My ass has got to hurry. Where does it go? There it goes. 30 seconds. Rude. Oh, there it is. Uh oh. 15 seconds remaining. Uh oh, we fucked up. It would help if I could shoot at stuff. Did we fail? I think we failed it. Oh no! Totally the first time I've done this. Ah. I think I made it. We did it. We did it. What? I did it. Fuck you, awkward voice recording. Guessing this isn't usually part of the course. This would happen. Break that shield. Break the shield. Okay. It's protecting Is this itself. Why it failed? Was it supposed to run in here?
shield yourself to level slash pass up. Ooh. Gold enemies. Oh yeah, that's right. They're immune. How do I shield? What? Whoa, that's cool. Hell yeah. Ooh, that's super useful. to have full health but it's fine we're going we're going Woo. we're almost toast did we make it did we make it it was a bit delayed there when we did the <laughs> the cleansing <laughs> we did it yeah Woo. Sweet. So that was the missing time key. Have a shield. Oh shit. <laughs> Need help, please. Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. Good. Okay, good. Maybe you can protect myself from the damn heat-seeking missiles, sir. Sir, I saw you. Okay, because I was like running that course, and I was like, "What the heck?" It kept saying I failed, even though I made it to the end. For some reason, I didn't see to go in this room until this this moment. Plastic tree, holiday memories tree A I one four dash A E containment procedure. Item must be contained within a soundproof cell. Description slash altered effect, a Holiday Memories brand white plastic tree with green plastic stand. The item repeats words and phrases spoken within a range of feet, always in a tone below hertz. This verbal mimicry has profoundly distressing effects on the individual it is copying. Background. The item was taken from the a Canadian research station established on Ross Island in Antarctica where it used to celebrate the holiday season. In 1979, solar radiation damaged the radio, severing the base's only means of communication with the world. After the frozen passages opened, a military expedition visited the base to re-establish contact. They found the base's occupants in various states of madness, rambling about voices in the tree, military personnel, discovered they also heard the tree speaking. After locking the item in a supply crate, they brought it back to the mainland, which at which point the bureau intervened. Woo, yikes. That's a bit rough. Oh, and this is the thing we opened, the OOP22-KE, so object of power, home safe. No unique procedures required. The object is a guardhouse brand safe uh, weight measurements vary. When bound, the object allows para-utilitarians to te telekinetically gather items and debris from their surroundings. The object is currently bound by us now. Uh, discovered in the basement of a home in Ohio, the object gained rapid interest in a certain online forums dedicated to abandoning, opening abandoned safes. After months of failure, the owner attempted to open it with explosives. The object survived with no physical damage. The bureau agents were dispatched, now confident of its paranatural nature. Blood occasionally... Ew. Ew. Blood occasionally emerges from the seam around the object's door. Tests confirm the blood is not human. X-rays taken of the object indicate that something is trapped inside, though the images are always blurred, which indicates the contents of the objects are moving. All attempts to open the object have been unsuccessful. Ew, it's a bleeding safe. Well, that's nasty. Cool. Well, we found that. That was definitely worth doing. To get our stuff. Sweet. All right, let's like actually do the mission at hand. Whee! 
So I got a shield now. I can jump. I can dash. Hell yeah. So black rock processing. This is obviously where we need to go. So let's get real. Any more friends? Oh, there's a, there's a, there's a... Gotcha, gotcha. Hey, <laughs> hey. Oh, hello, friend. There we go. Turbine room? So we can get into this one? Yeah. Oh, hello. Damn, what the heck? Ah, I was like, who? I was like, I killed this guy. Hey, buddy. Bye. Think that's everybody? Can we read this thing? All right. Listen, Trench is on the warpath about this Tanyinson report thing. He wants to know who wrote it, and he wants to know yesterday. Whoever did this is going to get crucified. I don't know if it was one of you guys, and I don't want to know. I'm not super keen on leading a witch hunt, so tell everyone in the sector to keep their heads down. Best not to be on anyone's radar right now, you know? I can tell you. I tell you, not even counting all the weird shit we deal with, this place can be a downright hostile work environment sometimes. Eh. Hey. Ooh. Fun. We love hostile work environments. Super healthy. Ooh. Can I just... No. <laughs> I gotta go around. Ooh, big door. I unlocked the thing over there, though. We did not go. Oh, shit. What is this? This looks exactly like that one that we opened that we couldn't get in. Whoa. Oh, boy. Do we get into it now? It doesn't look like it. Whoa. Because we, we went into that, like, maze one. It had the same mechanism. Is there somebody? No. Um, we couldn't get into it yet. But we do have uh, whatever it is that uh, Marshall gave us to help with the security measures um, that Darling put in place. So maybe we can get into it now. We'll have to go check at some point. Oh. Looks, uh, safe. Damn, is this how we process this stuff? Should I take it out? Aha. I was gonna say, maybe I should, like, not... Not power it. Going around. I guess I need a second one. Where can I steal one from? Oh no. Wasn't there one I grabbed? It's like quick access, like. Not that. Not that either. This one. Give me. Give me, give me. I got a thing. We can run. There we go. Door open. Hell yeah. That's either really good or really bad. Oh, hey. Whoa, Ocean View Motel. Why do we need this? The Reza Charm. Do we need to be here?
Somebody say, hello, you're open? Are you open? What? I don't think anyone's there, honey. Come on. We'll go to that motel we passed a while back. The Bates Motel. <laughs> That's hilarious. Does it just exist in the world? I like to check the rooms. I know it's the third one. But if there's a... See, there's things. Fix it. Put it back. Boom. Look at that. Put back to normal. Ooh, that one. Yeah, right? I don't know if that's what we have to do, but I assume it is. Oh, the chair's pulled out. Never mind. Chair's pulled out. Ish. So it is pulled out. Put that back. That's fine, that's fine, the plan's fine. So I think that's okay. More than one door open at a time? Trippy. So we gotta f Ooh, hello. We did it. Yeah, I think we did it. Casino. Did we ever get to go in the casino part of it? It does say motel and casino, so, you know. We're jamming. We love jamming. Let me in, please. Oh no. Dose. Make the epic transition. Boom. It's so cool the way they do that. Interesting, but what? purpose did that one serve? Did we get anything? Not really. Huh. Nobody spoke to us. Oh boy. Is this where we were? Black rock processing chamber. Is it open? Did we do this? Is that what that did? <gasps> it is. Ooh, we did it. We opened the thing. Trippy. Hell yeah. These doors are epic. A bit concerning why they're so massively. Okay, we need to find a way to Black Rock Processing. That's where Marshall said we'd find a prism. Large. Get out of here. I'm the boss. Don't watch me. Mushrooms? Alien mushrooms? Ooh. Okay. Atlas theory? Structural analysis. The atlas. The Atlas is a physical expression created by the oldest house. Its purpose and function are currently unknown. The specific shape and dimensions of the Atlas, see file ATL-034 for said dimensions, seem to indicate a more explicit purpose than the oldest house's unusual walls, floors, or shifts. The Atlas changes form, but resists observation when doing so. No visual observation has been made during its change, and it only ever occurs between frames when being monitored by surveillance cameras. A previous theory was that this change corresponds to house shifts and that the atlas is a of the itself. However, the shape changes do not occur at the same time as the building shifts, which makes this theory doubtful. Structurally, the atlas is made of the same material as the rest of the oldest house. Further observation will hopefully aid in discovering its purpose. Refer to file 8-37-35924 for full report. Hmm. So the atlas is a physical expression. That's very interesting. And it kind of behaves like the oldest house, but not the same way. And it's not necessarily responsible for its shifts either. Man, this way above my pay grade. I got Dr. Darling. 
I'll have to take your word for it, sir, because this is uh, it's going over my head. So we can't get into clearance level five yet. We only have four, but doesn't mean we can't be useful. Research major effects. What is this? Oh, this is you guys. So many things are happening. In maintenance. Anywhere but maintenance, rather. Uh oh. I hear gunfire! Does anybody need my help? Central maintenance. Oh. Can we unlock this? Yeah, we can. Hell yeah. Hello! We're coming to help! Get out of here! Toast! guys so you're a good guy whoa well that was intense you 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 doing okay there buddy I think your buddy's dead the one the other one <laughs> whoops so we can clear this point nice all right let's do it cleaning it up here Excuse me, what? Where? Sir? Hello? I heard him, but I didn't see him. Where, where is he? Hello? Arish? You upstairs? My sir. I did not see where. I'm assuming he's upstairs. Anyways, let's explore. I'm sure there's lots of goodies and information. Possibly. Or nothing. Yep, just straight up nothing. I didn't miss anything on this side, right? I don't think so. Okay, upstairs we go. Are you up here, sir? You chillin'? Yes? Ugh. Hello? Ah, is he in, he's in there. There he is. No? Other side? Damn it. He's trying to be lazy. Anything over here just before? Our agents discovered a light switch cord in a Butte bungalow closet. Uh. They pulled the cord and were instantly transported to the Ocean View Motel and Casino. Three times though. Dream like haze. Whoa. Inside, <laughs> they found a door marked with an inverted black pyramid. My sir. Just like that. It led back to the oldest house, some 2,000 miles from Montana. N now we're finding the cord in increasing numbers throughout the Bureau. Somehow the two places, they, they became in tune to each other. The, the actual physical location of the ocean view is, is, is a mystery. Stepping beyond its walls has so far proven impossible. But people can see it from the outside? Place of power. A little bit? Like the oldest house. Fancy. So fancy. 
<laughs> Dream like haze. Uh, I know Darlin's trying to have some fun, but <laughs> it's uh, kind of funny when we're dealing with like such serious things and he's like, oh man, we got to figure it out. And then at the same time, he's like, Woo! I love it though. That's like just the humor of Remedy. It's pretty great. Anybody panicking in here? Woo! Nice. We probably have a lot of things we need to like get rid of and do elements and upgrade and stuff. Glad to see you're still you. Hi. Likewise, sir. I'm not doing so hot. You're fine. We'll push through this. Yeah. The best of the ones doing the pushing, Doc. Oh. Walk it off. <laughs> Take care. Utilization of paranatural elements. Munitions testing on objective power 22, aka home safe. Oh no, you guys, it bleeds and it doesn't damage. The safe object of power can produce a barrier using objects or material from its immediate vicinity. See OOP202 case file for more details. Bureau Rangers were given permission to employ heavy weaponry against the parautilitarian bound to this object in order to gauge the barrier's durability. And. Velocity ammunition were tested with results. Testing will continue after this safe object of power is clearly a viable candidate for use in combat response scenarios, allowing peri-utilitarians to participate in altered engagements would be an advantage worth considering. Refer to file H-538367 for full report. Um, interesting. At least they know they can use it um to a degree at least para utilitarians can look at all these things ranger squad charlie seven returned from an expedition into the quarry threshold just after zero five hundred zulu can you please state your names and describe the purpose of your expedition kevin horowitz rupert wells our mission was to map quarry grid coordinates g29 Secondary objective, as always, was a few to hits. find a route we from the threshold entrance and maintenance to the formation. I think stable enough to move. Secondary objective was not a success. What a surprise. And did you encounter any previously unrecorded event or entity while inside the threshold? No. Nothing. Do you think we should tell them about the mermaid? Excuse me? Yeah, the mermaid. Horowitz here found this mermaid in the quarry just sitting on some black rock. She was singing this beautiful song, and he was overcome with desire. Oh, she was so alluring. I'd say she was more enchanting than alluring. <laughs> Fine, enchanting. Um, did you tell your CO about oh. this? No. Because it didn't happen. Nothing happened. As usual, the quarry is full of rocks. That's it. Can we go now? <laughs> Fuck you guys. <laughs> Get out of here. He fell for it, though. That's great. I mean, in this place, everything's weird. Honestly, if somebody was like, you know what, there was a mermaid, I'd be like, okay. I fell for it. Admittedly. Potential problem. Have you noticed the recent tension between Trench and Darling? They both have been acting odd lately. Trench concerns me the most. His sudden hostility towards Darling's project is very unlike him. He was the one to approve all of this Hedron research in the first place, but after Darling unveiled those HRAs, he was livid. I personally don't see any reason not to equip the Bureau of staff with additional protective device, especially if it's as strong as Darling says. What do you make of this? Have you seen anything from either of them that strikes you as odd? Let's talk to some person soon before the next Bureau heads meeting. M. So that's from Marshall to El Salvador. Ooh. So yeah, everyone is aware that something went down between them. Uh-oh. Hello. Hey, thanks for bringing down that, whatever the fuck that was. <laughs> You're welcome. But we are barely holding on here, boss. How's the situation outside maintenance? What do I tell him? Also fucked. The truth is harsh, but these people seem familiar with death. The hiss are everywhere. Most of the Bureau is lost. We need Black Rock Prism to make more HRAs for any survivors in the safe rooms. I'm here to check Darling's Black Rock Lab. So to recap, uh, death, disaster, and imminent destruction. Yay. Another day at the FBC. Aww. But Darling's lab is just past Black Rock Processing. 
I got good news and I got bad news on that front. Ah. Good news is, it's right down the hall. Bad news is, a hiss monster has decided to move in. Oh. So that's great. Good. Monster. Great. That's what the rangers said. The ones that survived, anyway. Uh, we are just treading water here, and the hiss keep coming. Salvador would know what to do, but apparently he took a security team into the containment sector just before the lockdown happened, and Ooh. well, no one's seen him since. He's the monster. But hey, at least we got you, our fearless leader. They shouldn't rely on me. Oh, Jesse. They don't know me. Jesse, come on, you're director now. They don't know how I failed people. We got this girl. Got You've this. done a good job here, Arish, but you should take your people and get to the base and executive. You can regroup there. I'll go deal with this monster. I'm getting kind of used to them. Yeah. Aye, aye, Faden. And be sure to put a bullet in that thing for me. Yes, sir. Get your people to safety. They're all dying. They're all freaking out. You're freaking out. They're freaking out. And with good reason, too. Definitely no, no. That shit, the hissers. <laughs> no blame. <laughs> yep. Everybody, get out of here. Let's go deal with your former boss. I'm certain it. It's been all of the heads so far. Like, all of the heads that... Have, of, like, the labs and stuff. Like, they've been turned into the monsters. The hiss got them. Oh, Sorry, buddy. Like, inevitably, we've run into all of the, like, former doctors. The former heads. Like, because they were, I guess, presumably on the front lines with all of their... All their people that got murdered and turned into hiss, so... Arish wasn't kidding about that monster. Yeah, literally. Why wouldn't the the heads also be turned into hiss? Oh, boy. Oh, good. Not good at all. You showed me the HRA when I first got here. And the machine that makes them. Can you help me find a prism? Yes, no, give me a sign. No sign? Uh-oh. He's like, I'm not sure about that one. You might be on your own. Ooh. Give me. Swan boat? Oh, Lord. No rubber ducks, no swan boats, guys. Take notes. Okay, AI19-KE. Contain procedure, no unique procedures required. This item is made of fiberglass painted to resemble a swan. Foot pedals allow the item to propel forward in water. The item emits a pulse of physical force at an estimated force of possible connection to object of power five. Uh, measuring the exact force created by the item has hindered my, by, has, has been hindered by concerns from the human resources department. Well, background, the item was seized from an activity rental service called on Lake on Vancouver Island, Canada, after it ejected numerous riders over the course of the summer, bringing the boat to the attention of the media. The item was transported to the Bureau by helicopter. A containment specialist accompanied it, sent to recite formulas C.9 through 32 recursively. What occurred in the helicopter is not known, but all agents were lost in the crash. Uh-oh. The item was recovered and then transported by train. It arrived at the Bureau without further incident. Aggressive swan. Yikes. Okie dokie. Is the swan the monster? It's hanging out. So there's this part that we need to take down. Oh, looky here. Okay. I see you. Let's do it. We gotta fix it. Shit! Uh-oh. They're shattered. Not a single prism left. Oh, is that what all this on the ground is, too? Oh. That's... What the fuck? Where are you? Is that the monster? Oh, shit. Miranda's here. Where is it? Where'd you go? Uh-oh. 
Is there anything specific we should do to fight it? Okay, I see you. I see what you do now. What is that thing? And I need some help. Holy moly. So you gotta like, get it. You gotta like, trigger it in a way. To like, show up. I see you. Let's hurry up and find Darling's lab. Ooh. Damn, that almost took me out for some reason. <laughs> I guess that's not good. What is that thing? Field research on his entity, his distorted agent. Is that really what it was? His distorted agents are able to render themselves invisible and emit a powerful concussive blast when in close range of their target. Oh, well, would have been nice to know. We, we found out the hard way. Curiously, the His distorted is apparently not able to utilize both abilities at once. It must make itself visible when it goes on the offensive. The His distorted is a unique in the fact that it wields paranatural ability previously unknown to the Bureau, perhaps tapping into the yet dis undiscovered object of power. How does this invisibility work? Does the distorted become resonance temporarily? Does it use his resonance to refract light? The physical deformation of this particular his entity is noteworthy in its thoroughness. Clearly a human host would have died from such extreme alteration, which prompts the question, are the corrupted simply animated corpses? Refer to file for full report. Yeah, I, I mean, I feel like it is, I mean, at least some of them are animated corpses. Like, the ones that are, like, bent in half, that, like, float at you and explode. Like, that's not alive. You know what I mean? Ugh. Well, that was interesting. That can't be the monster, though, I don't think. Lab one. I hope it's here. Man, these doors are extreme. I love it. There are areas in the oldest house where under the right conditions, when the frequencies match, oh. other dimensions leak in. We call these areas thresholds. The quarry is one of the more stable thresholds in the maintenance sector. That's, that's where black rock comes from. You heard that too, right? Matter. Black rock comes from a threshold out quarry. A so the prisms must be there too. Contained. Think of it as paranatural lead. Our research involves many dangerous things we absolutely need to keep in check. That's what the Black Rock Line fire breaks are about. The Panopticon container cells. Uh, sorry to interrupt, sir, but I need the code for the quarry elevator. Oh, uh, Emily. The codes. Black Rock 665. Neighbor of the Beast. Get it? <laughs> he doesn't seem hostile towards her. We can do that again. <laughs> we, we can, we can. We should do this again. Um, okay. I bet Jesse was talking over it to our little friend here, but we missed. He said something about like needing to contain it. Darling's key. <gasps> this. We got five. Should get us into the quarry. Hell yeah. Yeah, who needs papers? Um, so okay, yeah, it needs to be contained, controlled, or something, but we're not gonna listen to that. What's on the floor here? Okay, utilization of paranatural elements, Black Rock. Black Rock has allowed the Bureau to make great strides in containment procedures since it was first discovered. This report will examine how the very structure is comprised of density that nullifies all resonances within a range of 2 hertz. Euro innovations that incorporate black rock will be analyzed, most notably the fire breaks, feats of engineering designed to contain any future outbreaks, attacks, or internal threats. The goal of this report is to encourage Bureau staff to explore further innovations using Black Rock, as work in that field has markedly slowed in the recent years. 
refer to file 5-93-1733 for full report. So this is like maybe what the doors and stuff are made out of, like the, um, especially like the safe room doors, like the big safe-like things are made out of black rock essentially is what I'm hearing because they can contain um, and possibly deflect his resonance. So that's very interesting. Let me in! Black rock quarry, black rock processing. Ah! Give me! Everything here is crazy. Weird, but it feels... Normal? Right. Like how the world should be. Mm. I am in an infinite building leading to different dimensions and I never want to leave. Even with all the horror, I'm happy. <laughs> Me too. It feels sane. Then or just the right kind of insane. Then ma'am, why don't you want to lead them? You are the new director. You fit in here. Oh, we got friends. Howdy. He dead. That was unfortunate. Ooh. <laughs> Sweet. So we are running out of space on personal mods. So let's do a little bit of this. Let's see, we're at health 20. Six is close. <gasps> Ooh, this is way better. Hell yeah. But that means we can get rid of these. 28, 18, we don't need these. And then what's the other one I have is energy recovery speed. Maybe I should try... The energy boost could just be good. Maybe I'll try that because like the, the regen and whatever wasn't super effective consecutive kills ooh that could be good let's do that because we kill a lot of people so consecutive kills and getting credit for that would work are they chilling down here or we get everybody I think we got everybody What's this? Secret. It opened. Ooh, oh, we get. <gasps> oh my god, this is back to ventilation. Oh, hell yeah. Okay. So we found a quick way in. Nice. Hell yeah. Alright, that's nice. On we go. Expecting something else. I don't know why. I was like, pause process. Blackwood Corollary. Okay. All right. So this is where we. Oh. Oh, and there's another one. Claim it. It's mine. And then should we do any? Of this stuff, probably. What's this? Ooh, shield. Shield strength. Okay, we got seven things to play with. So let's definitely do a shield thing. Because why not? That seems useful. Um, okay, let's see. Large objects. The launch damage is honestly brutal. Because, like, we've been, like, throwing things and just taking people out with one hit. And it's pretty awesome. 20% um, to energy. We really need this. Like, energy's a problem a lot of times. Okay, I have three left. I could do 20% to health or 20% to energy. I probably should do health. I want to do energy, but I should probably do health because we just need it. It's not crucial, but I, I think it's good to keep it up. And then I was just seeing this. We can 
make these? So they have been like giving us the weapon forms. Oh yeah, okay. So we can, do we get two? Let's make one for sure. We have missions that say like we need to do stuff. Ooh, okay, and then let's look at this. Two. So just make one. Energy boost. Ah, uh -huh, okay. Ooh, energy recovery. 33. Okay, I gotcha. Accuracy boost. Okay. I gotcha. And then we can do this. Oh, we do. So I get a second one. Ooh, thank you guys for telling me. This is exciting. I saw it come through when I was taking a small break. I was reading some comments. Okay, so accuracy boost. We could add to it. Pierced. Exclusive to pierce. So these I think we should do because the... That's the exclu exclusive one. Let's do this. And then we can add the others. And then personal mods. We just made some of these. Energy boost. What do I have? Okay, let's definitely do this. Because it's better than what we had. And it's a rare one that we just made and then we got something like that because we were able to do the Ati thing I think is where it came from. Energy recovery speed. Yeah, we're still, I think we're good where we're at there. Okay, so that's some stuff. We're extra. <laughs> hmm. Oh, hi friend. <laughs> oh, toast. I see you. Oh, whoa. The other guy got me. That was rude. the gun this is cool whoa oh my god that thing is slow but powerful okay hell yeah that's definitely a hell of a shot how do I switch guns while we're dying. <laughs> uh, okay, dynamic energy extraction and conversion. Sarcophagus container, NSC. NSC was designed by the order of the deputy chief, Trench, shortly before he became director. The container provides a safe method of extraction of excess energy output while acting as a humane way to house him. The coolant pumps keep the container and its from overheating while the energy is siphoned. The energy is then conducted to the converters where it is rendered into a... through the use of turbine generators. The electricity produced powers the entire bureau, making it completely self-sufficient and effectively invisible to the New York City grid. After NSC-1's disappearance by some unknown manifestation of power, the occupant was restrained and a second model was built. NSC two possesses built-in spatial anchors that are designed to prevent any translocative effect from its occupant. Refer to file 9-23-0544 for full report. Okay, so they are 
trapping something that's alive. Humane implies human, but not necessarily. So they're trapping something using its energy, and that's how they're powering the bureau. That's a little concerning. I'm also gonna die. drop dead you could drop some health or just drop dead faster that would be good too yeah sorry not dying instantly <laughs> okay so uh, that was interesting that happened so is that where we need to go it looks like we can drop down to other levels, but I don't know how we would get back up. Yeah, currently, I don't want to drop down and then be like trapped. So we'll just continue on doing what we were doing. Fancy. I love that I just destruct everything around me as I go. Just wreaking havoc constantly so the other gun is very interesting it's like slower but more powerful so it'd be good for like bigger bosses and stuff oh boy shelter so this stuff this made of, this is made of like I guess like a black rock composite maybe and that's one of the reasons it's so effective in helping shield the employees that need to hide in here whenever shit goes down, which seems to be quite often. So that's very... Is there a thing up there? Nope. Doesn't look like it. Although it does look like we can get up there for some reason. Hmm. Maybe it's one of these. I gotta keep my eyes peeled. They like to hide things up above. I think we're good for now. Okay. In in this thing, I suppose. Elevator's broken. Oh. Gotta get down the old-fashioned way. Jump. <laughs> Hope you don't need ankles. We seem fine. There's nothing on the other side, right? No pages to read. Nope, but that sounds horrible. Something, something, something. Oh, I see you. Yeah, these things. Nasty, man. Floaty! Ugh. Yeah, those guys are for sure corpses. So unnatural looking. Doop. Down. Down we go. Good times, good times. Climbing the pipes. Oh, not all the way down! Ah! Whoops. Didn't I say? Something about corpses? I was talking about mine. Okay, not gonna fall to our death this time. Yup. Does that fix the elevator? Of elevator for Jen? I doubt it. Oh, I figured out how to switch weapons. So you can just tap X to do so. Yup. And then like, ooh. Explosion. 
Lodi. Bam. Okay, we're going down slowly but surely. Not gonna fall to my death again. Oh, look at me just breaking the ventilation system. <laughs> Is there a better place to go from here? Can I use my shield to drop safely? Or does it not matter from this point? There we go. Oh boy! I don't know if that was like all of them, but there's a lot of them. Where are you guys? I don't see him. Sir, pretty rude. The where the hell? What the heck? What the hell? He's stuck? I was like, where the hell? Did he get smushed? Did he get smushed? That's kind of fucked up. in there. <laughs> I think that's a glitch. Can I cleanse the point? No. Oh, there he is. There he is. You made your way out? Good. So I was gonna get real awkward. Fix it. Kind of fucked up. Damn, look at the destruction. But yay! That was gonna be really awkward if that guy was like stuck in there and just. Yep. Alright, hell yeah. Anything around the room? If needed? Doesn't look like it. Mm, doesn't look like it. Okay, hell yeah. Well, let's keep on keeping on then. Not destruct all of the rocks, please. We need them. <laughs> I just love that it takes them out pretty much in one shot. Who just shot me? I think it was the guy I took out. <sighs> Nevertheless, let's get some health. Yay! Nice. Okay, there's a lot of people here. To be expected. I think these all probably loop. Oh, look at that on the map. Nice. Anything? <laughs> I'm just taking out mining equipment <laughs> or whatever this is. 
Is this the thing? No? Not gonna let me in? That's rude. Let's find a way in then, shall we? <laughs> oh my god, they're all just hanging out. Oh. Sorry, guys. We need additional diamond blades ASAP. Continue as rim this time to get the clean cut research wants. This black rock shit is tough. We're going through blades like we're made of the damn things. The dimensions of these slabs of black rock they want are outrageous. The, for all the grief they're causing me, these fire breaks better fucking work like a treat. Go ahead and double the last order. Okay, so they're using diamond blades. That makes sense. I mean, diamond's one of the toughest substances in the world and it looks like this black rock is something yeah that's normal oh boy whoa oh, not what I expected that's cool I almost wish they like they showed us a glimpse of it I almost wish they didn't from before when they did the little flashy thing but like wow this is for sure looks like an extra dimension like this does not look like our dimension like this looks looks like extraterrestrial can't talk still but you guys know what i mean extraterrestrial like this this whoa hell yeah hello oh, this is cool <sighs> Gotta all check. We gotta check all the nooks and crannies. <laughs> Looks like there's quite a lot of them too. Okie dokie. Like whoa. Oh, I see you guys. Look at all this, like, floating rock and stuff. Oh, man. We stumbled upon uh, the other side of Amnesia, the bunker. They're not glowing, though. They're, they are power player. Ah, so our way, the, this is the way back then. I think. Yeah. So we unlocked this door. Nice. Very nice. Oh, what was that? A thing. <laughs> All bureau personnel are reminded to kindly not smoke in the quarry. Even though the quarry area is technically an outdoor space, it is part of the bureau, therefore no smoking rule does apply. Not only is it considerate towards your fellow employees to refrain from inflicting the harm of secondhand smoke, it is also prudent to avoid any risk of gas, fires, unforeseen threshold reactions, and possible creation of altered receptacles. Under no circumstances should cigarette butts be left in the quarry. Thank you for your understanding. Whoa, could you imagine if your cigarette butt came and attacked you? That sounds concerning. I love their notes are like humorous and also you know they're dead serious. <laughs> Might as well kick it off. Dead. Toast. Ooh. Activate explosive to excavate the black rock prism. Holy shit, I think we found the explosive. You guys, 
I can do it too. couple of different guys at me this time. Little rude. So I gotta do... Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I gotta get the power of things. Now. Okay, so I need two more. Not that. Bam! And then where's... There. Sir. Ma'am. Please. <laughs> We're doing good. We're having a good time. That doesn't sound good. Woof. I think we did it. Collect all of the stuff. Nice. Incident report. Quarry operations. During my weekly safety inspection of the quarry threshold, I discovered the entire crew was in a state of... The whole team was aligned and staring in a uniform direction. The city in the distance. Despite my most vocal efforts to gain their attention, they remained for more than minutes until I had to resort to literally... After they were dazed and could not provide any rationale for their behavior or any specific memories of engaging in it. My official recommendation for any crew working in a threshold area is to shorten the length of their shifts or carry out or to carry out mandatory psychological evaluations on a weekly basis or preferably both. And maybe we should order another expedition to the city. Capital C city. Refer to file 5-58 3096 for full report. Uh-oh. Could it be the origin of like the hiss? Like or like the origin of like how they get like mesmerized and stuff? Is this it? Should we touch it with our hands? And there it is. Right where you led me. Boom. The HRAs, the prisms, they mean something to you. I need to get this prism to Marshall before it's too late. Um, HRAs, then Dylan. There's a thing though. I don't know. If, oh, there's a couple things. Oh, that's not good. <laughs> I just need to get around you, fuckers. Because we can take the shortcut that we unlocked. Oh, if I go get killed, oh no. <laughs> Stay put. Maybe, maybe. Oh, they're everywhere. Uh oh. Hmm. Well, that's not good. Okay. They definitely made it a black rock, too, so that's concerning. That's probably why they can't be, like, des destroyed, you know what I mean? So we get to collect our rare weapon mod. Hell yeah. Shatter projectile boost. Huh. Cool. So this was the other thing, is why I did the pierce gun, because I remembered that we needed to do this one. Kill enemies with a service weapon in pierce mode. So there's only five of them, so it might as well. So I'll just put that there, and then let's fast travel to... Where's Marshall? Okay. 
I forgot for a second that she we told her to come here and Every meet us here. Ma'am, I got the things. Had to take a detour into the quarry, but I found plenty. Here. We will start HRA production immediately. Wait. I promised I'd tell you about Dylan once you helped us. This is it. She knows. She's gonna be like, I don't actually know a lot, sorry. 17 years I've waited. Your brother is here. He was once known as Prime Candidate 6, codenamed P6. We, we've heard of We that. brought him here after the ordinary event. He was groomed to be the future director. He had talents far beyond any other candidate in the program. Of course he did. We found you together. We share a bond. Are you with him now? So you kidnapped him? We took him in. Your parents vanished along with every other adult in Ordinary. Eventually, his power changed him. There were casualties. He wasn't fit to be the director. Did you know about this? Is this why you didn't bring me here sooner? Were you keeping me away? Where is Dylan? He's kept in the containment sector, in the Panopticon. My brother... I thought we were the same. What if we are? But she seems I'm like going. She has more control. Now. I expected as much. I need to go check on something. Something I cannot let the Hiss find. It shouldn't take long, but you must watch the Bureau while I'm gone. And remember, Dylan is dangerous. Do not let him out, Director Faden. How do I make her stop calling me that? I'm not here for them. Too late. Nothing simple here. These people took my brother, but they've accepted me without question. Are they my enemies or my friends? I need to see Dylan. I need to know. I wish you could tell me what you know, explain things. Just stay with me, okay? I could use a friend right now. How do we know that that thing in us is a friend? <laughs> it's our name. Oh my god, he is alive. Uh-oh. Colin, any word on survivors? We've located numerous safe rooms with survivors inside. We're waiting on HRAs before we open them. Once we can safely bring them out, survivors will be escorted here straight away. Oh Wonderful. Boy. Keep me updated. Yep. Holy shit. Okay, I'm gonna go over here so I don't hear anybody. But, so, wait. Dylan's alive. Like, actually alive. And dangerous. So, I mean, to be expected, if... Kind of... I would say to be expected, but... I We didn't guess it, but... I would say, like, it makes sense rather than to be expected. It makes sense that he would have similar powers to Jesse since they're related. Um, but it definitely seems like she's got more control over her powers. And we definitely read something. I don't know if I can find it. We definitely read one of the files that had mention of P6. It was like when we were talking to Emily. I can't find it, but it definitely um, had... There was some correspondence or something we picked up, or maybe it was a conversation with Emily, um, Emily Pope, that, because they mentioned P6 before. Like, I remember that term, and that's our brother, so that's really interesting. So he's, like, here, he's dangerous. He's essentially held captive now because he's dangerous. I wonder if, like, his powers, like, overtook him instead of him taking control. Uh -huh of the his powers right um and it it's corrupting him the way that the hiss corrupts the agents and stuff around but maybe to a different degree like hmm or if not maybe he just has ill intentions and that makes him 
like that power feeds it. You know what I mean? I don't know. We'll find out. I think. I think whatever it is, like he's not going to be good. Like Jesse's going to have to get rid of him. Such is such a horrible way to put it, but like she's going to have to let him go in order to move on, and choose her loyalties right to her brother but she's gonna realize her brother's like not good and then she's not here for the fbc but i think she's gonna have to be um okay one last thing before we go we found this contain resources loot can be constructed crafted into mods forms we advocate facilitate this at control points menus this will only be available exclusive for the director oh so i guess this is just like how we made their gun so that's what that was okay well we are certainly progressing through this chapter concludes the halfway point so we've officially made it like halfway through the game so it makes sense that we're like starting to find a little bit more and like deeper into the mystery i'm glad that we got to help save some people with the hras and like do our duty as director even though she doesn't want to be and we got to help ati a little bit the damn clog was back but we did it we vanquished it this time and it was considerably smaller so maybe it doesn't come back again um but yeah anyway so far so good i think we've been relatively thorough we did um two extra missions i think um and then i'm getting the hang of like their menu system as far as like finding the different missions so like the time missions that pop up to be anywhere but where you're at um we don't need to worry about too much so i don't know if i'll do any of those we'll see where we're at they, they tend to pop up when i'm in the middle of stuff um and then the board um missions will do because they're easy to just kind of like do as you're going and then yeah we'll just see what we get to as we go through it um i've been trying to find some of the side missions um i believe we did the good defense one was one of the side missions and then we have the shield power now so that's good um it's really interesting that the side missions are like they give you pretty essential powers like i would say like having a shield is a really big deal and then having like the the jump the dash is like a really big deal as well um but they're considered side missions which is really kind of strange to me that it feels like they should be essential missions but i suppose you don't need them um very interesting love it all the same love the humor that we get peppered in through everything and um i'm very curious about the black rock and kind of what more we can do with it. I, like the way that it floats and that it seems to be like an inner dimensional stuff. Like there definitely doesn't seem like a natural outside. Do you know what I mean? Like when they were, when we were out in the quarry, they're like outside, but not outside. Um, I mean, just like everything else in the building, it, it is, but it isn't. You know what I mean? I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Control. We will get to the next one, which is my brother's keeper and hopefully find out more about Dylan and maybe more about the thing in our head um i think well obviously it's not dylan um but maybe we'll be connected to him through it or something like that or he'll sense it and it'll be bad or something like that but it's not gonna go well no matter what i just i can't you know what i mean it's not gonna especially with the bloody jesse on the wall the for foreshadowing mm. anyways it's gonna be cool thank you everybody so much for watching and please don't forget to give this video a like and subscribe I will see you guys in the next one for more control. Goodbye!